think it's a very, very bad idea. <laughs> They're gonna be so angry. Oh, oh my god. god. You need to give me your autograph. Yeah. You know why. And you don't approve. I don't approve. But you need to do quite a few of them so I can pick the best one. Why am I not sign my name anymore? But I don't know how to do it. Well, I do. The pressure is on because this will be on my body for life. So, yeah, just keep going. <laughs> Dad signs his name all the time. But I yeah. Do. I think that's more than enough. Perfect. Thank you. Right. Am I going the other side? Yes, please. Oh, I don't like doing this. Just keep going. You do sign your name. No, never. No. Mm. You, you always used to when you used your card or when Not I was at work, you did. How do you feel about this going on my body? I think it's a really moving thing to do. Yeah, thanks. I think it's really nice. I think so too. Yeah. I'm glad you think so. Dad's just old fashioned, isn't he? He is. I'll go get his opinion before he leaves for golf. <laughs> well, you'll have it there when we're dead and gone. Well, exactly. It's not as neat as it used to be. Also, though. try a bigger one if you can, just in case I ever use, I need a big one. Although I'm sure whoever I go to can blow oh, it up. Oh, they're a mess when they're That's all right. I won't use those then. <laughs> but that's why I've got you to do loads, so then I can... You've got yeah. loads. Perfect. Thank you so much. <laughs> there they go. I'm going to need to choose one of each. That's it. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> so what's your opinion of that going on my body? I think it's a very, very bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> why? It just damages you for life. Yeah. Do you think so, I'll regret it? Yep, yeah, you will. When I'm how old? Probably during it. Okay, <laughs> during. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, thanks for doing it, even though you don't agree with it. <laughs> what did you just say? You said you'd come with me. I said I'd come with you, yeah. And get one done as well? Yeah. Do you want to get the same tattoos, maybe matching not, tattoos? Well, maybe not the same. Okay. Maybe different ones. Okay. Well, that's fine. You've already got some. I've got a couple, yeah. How did mum and dad react when you showed them yours? Uh, they were, they were uh, indifferent. <laughs> Maybe that's the nicest thing. Oh, that's there. good. Yeah. Indifferent. They were a bit shocked. Okay. Like yeah. 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 But I think you sort of have to be nice with tattoos. That kind of, you can't really say it. That's, <laughs> that's you horrible. Say. Yeah. Oh, it's lovely. It's an interesting <laughs> choice. Yeah, lovely, yeah. No, yours are nice. Oh. But, um, okay. Well, we'll see. Maybe I need to decide where I'm going first, but um, we can go along and then you get yeah. something drawn up. <laughs> we'll get matching ones. <laughs> he doesn't like it. Hey guys, so it's months later. I'm now 30. Um, I've been 30 for a week, just over a week. But anyway, it's time for me to get my tattoo. I've got the signatures that my parents signed for me that you saw in the clip months previously. I can't even remember when that was. But I'm going for my tattoo. I'm very nervous. I'm going somewhere that's been recommended to me. One of my friends got a tattoo here, but I don't think it's with the same artist. So I am a little bit nervous. But yeah, it's a place in London Bridge. Um, and people always get confused when I say things like that but it's because London Bridge isn't just a bridge, it's a place. So when I say I'm in London Bridge, I don't mean the bridge, obviously. <laughs> I mean the area. But anyway, here we are. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm a little bit early, so I'm just gonna walk around the block. I'm only 10 minutes early, but it did say on there, don't get here early. <laughs> just, to, you know, for COVID restrictions. So it's not like me, I like to be early for things. Anyway, I still don't know the layout that I want. Like, I don't know how I want them on my arm. Do I want them one above the other? Do I want them next to each other? Do I want them on an angle? Like, I have no idea. So I'm gonna have to just make it up when I get in there and hope for the best. I just wonder how painful it's gonna be. Like, is it gonna be excruciating? I mean, Lucy, my housemate, has tattoos. And so she told me it just feels like a scratch. She was like, it'll be uncomfortable, but it won't be like unbearable. <sighs> I don't know. Look what I've just stumbled across. It's called Texas Joe's. It says it's open. Look, tacos, right in the middle of London. Crazy. Me and Leah need to come here. Right, all done. My arm is wrapped up in cling film and uh, it was quite painful. It wasn't like unbearably painful. It was just, I didn't know what to expect and I wasn't too scared of it in terms of the pain. I was just scared in terms of will I like it? And from what I've seen so far, I absolutely love it. As I said, I wasn't sure what placement to do, but I just let him kind of 
take the lead because obviously he's probably a bit more creative than me, he's seen more tattoos. So I said I wanted a, a really small size and he was like, no, I think we should go bigger. And then I was like, shall I put them next to each other? And he was like, no, have them on a slant like this. And it's actually turned out really, really good. So I'll show you guys when I'm home. I've got this whole aftercare sheet, so I don't really know. I need to read that and I've got to get some cocoa butter now. And I definitely need a Diet Coke as a reward. <laughs> I'm such a child. Yeah, I need to get some like cocoa butter. I'm not allowed to go to the gym for a few days and just got to look after it basically. Right, I'm outside one of my favorite places in London, Shakespeare's Globe. I was in a show there once. I mention it in every vlog, <laughs> pretty much, but that was years ago now. Um, anyway, I stopped and I got a Diet Coke and some chocolate covered rice cakes as a reward for being a really brave boy. Because um, my parents aren't here to reward me for being brave. Um, although they are now in a way, on my arm. Although they're not dead, my parents are alive, but I made it sound like they were dead. Anyway. I'm just gonna relax because that was a stressful experience. Right, so it's a couple of weeks later and my parents are coming to my house this morning. They're arriving in about 20 minutes and I've just hopped out the shower. I'm actually butt naked right now, so hopefully no one's gonna be in my front garden because they will get a lovely view. But anyway, I would like to prank my parents before showing them the tattoo, which is healing really well and it looks really great now. Um, but I've bought a fake, a temporary tattoo to go on my arm, like a massive sleeve, because I did say to my parents, who generally are, are like more anti-tattoos, they don't really understand it, and, and they're supportive of me getting it, obviously, but they're a bit like, and one of my brothers has lots of tattoos, so they're fine with it, but they're more on the anti side than the pro side, and I mentioned that I would like to have a sleeve one day, and they were like, no, no, you can't, no. And so I'm gonna prank them. And so I'm gonna put this on and hopefully it's accurate and hopefully it's like, it looks real. But I just need to apply it. They're gonna be so angry. <gasps> okay, I need to let it dry. I can't wait. Okay, so I think my parents have arrived. They're parking, I think according to the journey they sent me. I've actually bought them some cakes and stuff, like a nice chocolate cream cake. I've bought a cinnamon swirl and like some plum jam pastry thing. So uh, what I'm planning on doing is showing them straight away and then easing them with the real tattoo and <laughs> the cakes. I'm actually nervous, even though I know it's not real and it's a joke and it's funny. There's a part of me that's nervous about the reaction. Either they will think it's real and there will be a genuine reaction, or they'll know it's fake, because they are clever, and they know what I'm like, but we'll see. Even if they believe it for just a split second, it'll be funny. Yeah. Are you ready? It's been months, yeah, isn't are. it? We are very ready. So, the big reveal. The only thing is, what I haven't told you... is a spelling mistake. There is a spelling mistake. No, I actually ended up getting a different one as well. Oh, did on you? <laughs> oh, oh my no. god! I know. Wow, let's have a look. What is the point in that again? Just for uh, being cool. I like the colours, Joel. And it's still healing, so that's oh, why. Oh, is it so? I don't think it feel ill. I know. <laughs> All the ink in my body. I like it. It probably is. It's all like poison. I like the shape of it. I like the fact you've gone for a, a shape yeah. that's in it completely. Yeah. Developing the whole. But I need to now get one on the inside there oh, and down goodness. there. And then maybe even down to my hand. Have you told your brothers? Uh, no. <laughs> well, I should also say this is a temporary tattoo. Oh, is it? <laughs> 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 what? You very sore. I was thinking, oh, it's not a tattoo. I mean, it's sore. peeling around the elbow, so I was like, oh, it's still <laughs> healing. <laughs> healing or peeling? Oh, yeah, you see? Oh, that's really. <laughs> I bought it on eBay and I, this morning after my shower before you arrived, I was like, quick, I need to do it before they arrive. <laughs> it's so ugly, why did you think I got this? I chose the ugliest well, one. Your, your taste oh. recently have been rather suspect. <laughs> <laughs> well, the real one is there. Oh, oh that's lovely. That looks almost real. It does, that's doesn't it? It? What, it seems surreal seeing our writing on your arm and we yeah. haven't done it. It's strange, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah, I'm glad I didn't know whether to have them like one there, one there, or on top of each other, but he I is like, like I think the yeah. slant, because that's how people yeah. write naturally. Yeah. And I quite like, I like that. that. It's nice. So you're going to show our reaction to that? Yeah. <laughs> 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 you were quite good, both of you, at being a bit like, 
okay. <laughs> and you were like, oh, it's good that the shape is <laughs> trying to find the positives. That's what I do, isn't yeah, it? <laughs> exactly, but I've now got to try and get this off because apparently they can last for a week, so maybe oh. later we'll get some white spirit yeah. on it. <laughs> it was only four quid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, to be, honest, to be honest, I do think it looks quite cool. I don't think I'd ever do it, but I did. I was like, wow, it looks cool. Uh, I, don't, I think I did show them the process of it. So I tried to find like the ugliest one that I could. <laughs> Like with a tiger and everything. And going, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I do quite, I do quite like it. But I don't think I would ever get one. But it's, uh, yeah. I did actually show Luke and Ben. I sent them a photo before we arrived. I was like, by the way, I'm pranking mum and dad today. And Ben was like, oh my goodness, I saw the photo before I saw what you wrote. And I was like, what's he done? <laughs> and he was like, is it real? And I was like, no, of course it's fake. And then Luke, they were both like, you need to show, show us their reaction. <laughs> 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 so just to help them recover from the shock that was my tattoo, I got them some pastries. So there's a fork, by the way. Put it over here so the dogs can't get at it. But we've got this chocolate cream cake. We've got a plum jam donut and a cinnamon swirl. Hey everyone, it's the next day and the tattoo has come off. There's still a few little black bits, but it was quite easy to get off with nail polish remover. And my real one is looking great. I really, really love it. But anyway, the final part of the prank was I put it on my Instagram story, as you can see. And I'm just going to read through some of the messages that I got about it because it's, it's divided opinion. So in terms of the poll, I put a poll up but whether you like it or don't like it basically. And 72% like it and 28% don't like it. So that was a lot more like people that liked it than I thought. I thought everyone, like I deliberately chose the ugliest tattoo in my opinion and people still liked it. But don't get me wrong, I actually really liked it as well in terms of placement. I'm like, oh, maybe I should get a sleeve because it looks so cool. Uh, just not that one. Love the body, just not particularly a fan of the tattoo. I don't mind little tattoos, but big tattoos seem a bit much. Still love you, honey. Thank you. This person says, what? <laughs> I also got lots of thirsty replies. Uh, this is probably the tamest of the thirsty ones because the replies, some of them are gross and too explicit to show on camera. Uh, this person says, damn, bringing that heat. I agree, I think tattoo sleeves are hot. Not to toot my own horn. This person says, it's a touch too much. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Anyway, that's the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. It's been a journey. I absolutely love it. Do you know what? I was really lame. My parents are still alive. They're not dead. But I was watching Six the Musical. You might have seen that vlog, or if not, it's coming up soon. And I was like, oh wow, I wonder if mum and dad would enjoy this. And then I was like, mum and dad are here with me in a way, because... They're on my body, um, which is so lame and so weird. But anyway, I really, really love it. I don't know if I'll ever get another tattoo. I would love a sleeve, but I'm just thinking if I ever want the fashion statement of a sleeve, I'll just buy another big temporary tattoo. They're only like three quid, so I could just do that. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you're new here and you want to subscribe and you like my videos, then do that. I post videos every single week. Also, don't forget I'm on Cameo. If you want a personalised video, the link is down below. And if you want to become a member, this is my final notice. <laughs> if you want to become a member, you can click join next to subscribe and you can get members only live streams. So consider that if you haven't already and I'll see you soon. Bye.